Hello, my name is Anja Radite, and I am working in Human Initiative, a humanitarian foundation headquartered in Indonesia. Indonesia is a country located at the meeting point of three major continental plates. It is located on one of the corners of the Pacific Ring of Fire. Uh, where 90% of all earthquakes occurs. Indonesians have lived among uh, many kinds of disasters, from tsunami to uh, nowadays extreme weather, like tornadoes, where, which have caused displacement of peoples uh, in bigger magnitude of disasters. Because of this, Indonesia is named by many as the supermarket of disaster. Cluster system, mostly activated in times of disaster. Cluster system in national level is led by the national government, the central government, supported by international NGO or UN agencies which coordinate with UN OCHA and local and, or national NGO as well, like we are. Now, local NGOs are welcome to join the cluster meetings. Uh, unfortunately, most of the time, a lot of them uh, stop coordinating after several few meetings. This is mostly due to the gap of uh, capacity. Human Initiative uh, works uh, in sectors like wash, uh, shelter, logistics, food security, and nutrition. Human Initiative referred to the humanitarian charter where humanitarian action should be imperative. That action should be taken to prevent or alleviate human suffering arising out of disaster or conflict. Uh, we have experienced several uh, localization initiatives by several uh, international NGO partners. Uh, the Catholic Relief Service, uh, for example, have trained us for more than three years in uh, a program called Preparing to Excel in Emergency, PEER for short. The Triple CM camp management uh, with IOM were just recently introduced uh, to us uh, in order for us to implement with all the necessary uh, adjustment of course that we consider is fit for uh, Indonesia's context and human initiatives values. Uh, other international NGOs uh, of course have also shared uh, some of their key knowledge on uh, disaster response. As organizations which gain benefit from uh, localization, we have delivered uh, the knowledge we obtain to other local partner NGOs. And we also have done so to journalists uh, by conducting various workshops and trainings, ensuring Indonesia's vast needs of quick and uh, proper response is met with the required standards. We, we note that uh, an immediate positive impact after the triple CM training uh, we obtained from IOM. Uh, the case was in Palu, where there was uh, IDPs uh, at the, uh, a complex uh, of a masjid or mosque. Uh, they were one of the most challenging problems to be solved by the local government. At the same time, the, the, there was a reconstruction progress uh, that, that progresses uh, on, the, on, the, on the complex or the, the mosque. Now, uh, this makes the complex full of ruins and materials, which is dangerous for the IDSPs, especially children, to live. Our team, uh, using participatory approach, that we learned uh, during the triple CM uh, uh, training, well, our team was able to identify what the community really need and some FGDs were also done. And participation uh, also include balanced number of men, women, people with disabilities or their representatives. In the end, the triple CM training have provided us with the knowledge to conduct better management of refugees in camps in central Sulawesi. Thank you for, uh, for uh, attending this session. Uh, you are welcome to, uh, to provide comments on, uh, on my presentation. Thank you.